my recommendation would be to start with one food, so fermented veg or a fermented drink, and you will soon find just how many ways you can weave that one food or that one um, drink, whether it's milk kefir, water kefir or kombucha, into your life. In fermented foods, we we created this amazing environment where beneficial bacteria thrive. So with the salt and with the exclusion of oxygen, we let those lactobacillus bacteria thrive. So when we're eating those vegetables, we're getting all of those microbes going through the, us too. And whilst they might not move in, we know they're exchanging genetic material, they're producing byproducts as they go through us. Kefir is really good for you. It's good for you in so many ways, especially if it's made with cow's milk. Milk is full of protein, and when the bacteria start to get going on those proteins in the milk, it breaks them down into tiny little bits of protein called um, bioactive peptides, and they stimulate your immune system. So already you're looking at a, a whole new range of foodstuffs that you wouldn't normally have in your diet that can have a really good effect on stimulating your immune system, helping you to have a healthy gut lining. And we now know that 60% of the immune system is based in the gut. So it's a really good place to start. If you can't make it yourself, you can go to your local supermarket and you can buy a whole range of delicious ones. For example, you could get the Yeo Valley pot of kefir yogurt which is frankly delicious. <laughs>